The most recent focus uh, for the financial services industry has been on improving regulatory reporting procedures for banks and financial institutions. And in practice, it means increased automation uh, and digitization of KYC and AML rules, as well as tax reporting. Artificial intelligence and machine learning in particular is being widely recognised as technology that uh, would enable financial institutions to operate more effectively under regulations but also to strip down the enormous cost uh, needed for the companies to detect and examine fraudulent and suspicious cases. AI can be plugged in on top of the existing uh, rule-based systems um, at different stages of the KYC and AML processes. But the question is, is it possible to minimise the operational uh, cost of the AML divisions with lowering uh, the risk of false negatives and false positives at the same time? Thanks to unsupervised techniques, we are able to uh, indicate any anomalies in clients' behaviour um, that uh, could be indicative of uh, real money laundering cases and they are sometimes uh, difficult to be picked up by a human um, or currently existing uh, rule-based systems. AI is able to spot uh, any anomalies, um, non-linear discrepancies, odd similarities and so on. And subsequently, um, it's also able to detect new ways of money laundering implemented by the criminals. Supervised machine learning techniques, on the other hand, uh, they can be employed uh, to investigate the data related to already existing and alerted um, cases. Using these techniques, uh, we are able to create a risk score of money laundering uh, cases uh, per individual uh, case. From the technology point of view, I think it's undeniable that uh, common processes, KYC and AMO processes, uh, can be upgraded with AI with great results.